Marketing Cloud Intelligence is one centralized platform for all your marketing data and insights. It gives marketers real-time performance insights, helps you make data-driven decisions, and serves as a single point of truth for all your marketing data. The goal of this video is to give you a quick orientation to intelligence, so you'll be comfortable with the navigation and core capabilities. After today's demo, learn more about Marketing Cloud Intelligence through help.salesforce.com articles and training modules on Trailhead. Let's look at the tool. To log in, go to platform.datarama.com. The first thing you'll see is the overview of the Visualize tab. Notice the sidebar and four key tabs at the top. Visualize, Analyze and Act, Connect and Mix, and Marketplace. For each of those tabs, there are three to five main functions to know about. This first tab is where you visualize your data. Create collections with dashboard and app pages, bring the data to life with widgets, and customize the views with filters. Under the next tab, Analyze and Act. Analyze your data and share the actionable insights through reports. Measure KPIs with goals and actions. The Connect and Mix tab is where you'll import your data via data streams so you can classify and manipulate your data. Finally, under the Marketplace tab, you'll find intelligence apps that offer a range of solutions based on real use cases and customer feedback. Also notice the helpful features to the top right. Use the magnifying glass to quickly find specific features. Click the Resources icon to access help and training or to open a support ticket. Notification Center keeps you informed of data streams and other notifications. Under Workspace Settings, Manage User Accounts, Access Activity Logs, and Configure Settings. And depending on your contract, you may have access to the Sandbox tool as a testing environment for your intelligence workspace. Now let's check out the left menu bar and workspaces. Each account has at least one workspace that contains its own data streams dashboards, reports, goals, and actions. Some accounts have multiple workspaces. For example, a large global account may have a workspace related to each continent in which they do business. To switch between workspaces, click on the workspace box in the top left corner of your screen. When you click a new tab, the left menu bar shows you the actions available for the tab you selected. Let's take a look. Admins spend most of their time in the Connect and Mix tab, so we'll start there. This is where you'll import your data via data streams. Use any of the offered methods, API connectors, Total Connect, Light Connect. After you import the data, you can manipulate it with the various features available in the Connect and Mix tab. View, Manage, and Create Data Streams from the Data Stream list. Upload and connect to virtually any data set, including marketing vendors. Click Create New, and you'll see hundreds of marketing vendors you can automatically connect to via API Connector. For sources or data sets that don't have an API Connector, use the Total Connect feature to create a data stream and ingest data. Total Connect streams can be updated via email, SFTP, or FTP transfers. With data stream templates, create mapping templates for future data streams, reducing the need to recreate mappings each time. For example, many clients have different Facebook profiles and you can apply that same template to all and not recreate the mappings every time. With data load rules, we filter data before it's uploaded into the platform, avoiding the need for backend filtering. For example, we might apply a filter to only load data for certain regions or specific campaigns. Data mapping provides an overview of how dimensions and measurements are mapped to data sources. The Harmonization Center lets you unify, enrich, and validate your data. This is where you'll manage naming convention patterns, data classifications, and harmonize dimensions. The Patterns tool lets you extract individual dimension values based on naming conventions. The Data Classification tool lets you classify your data using a lookup table. The dimension list shows available dimensions in your workspace. Use calculated dimensions to manually create customized dimensions. Measurements are quantitative numerical data that you can count, like the number of email opens or clicks. Calculated measurements represent a query that you can reference from any report 
pivot table, or widget in your dashboard pages. Use filtered measurements to customize measurements based on specific dimensional values. Let's pivot to the Analyze and Act tab. This is where you'll analyze your data and share the actionable insights through reports. Measure KPIs with goals and actions. Use Einstein Marketing Insights, or EMI, to analyze data and tell you what factors are affecting your marketing performance. Use Goals Track and assess key performance indicators. The Goal Tool helps you monitor your progress against benchmarks you set. Activation Center is where your actions and action rules live. Actions are your interaction with your channel or campaign. An action might be to send a Slack message to your reporting channel or to pause a campaign on Facebook. Action rules define triggers for your action. Next up, visualize and distribute data in reports. Pivot tables let you view data just like in many other spreadsheet applications. Tableau Data Connection lets you send reports to your Tableau instance. Database Exports let you export harmonized data to databases. The Visualize tab is where you'll create and customize marketing dashboards for data visualization. This section includes collections and pages, which are like workbooks and sheets. For example, you might have a collection called Marketing Dashboards, and each page within that collection holds different visualizations. As you can see on this dashboard, each box is a separate widget that can be adjusted to show different data points. To add a widget, click this pencil icon. Optionally adjust filters, dimensions, and measurements for each widget. Click into this box and see the many widget options to visualize your data. In the Marketplace, explore a variety of apps to give you fast solutions for common use cases. One that's worth special mention is the Salesforce Marketing Cloud app. Many apps have a View Demo button to give you an idea of how it works. This app takes all your Salesforce Marketing Cloud data and serves up great out-of-the-box visuals. It's like having a data visualization expert at your service. Another example is the Social Intelligence app. This is a game changer for analyzing social media data. Imagine you work for a PR firm that markets on YouTube, LinkedIn, Instagram, and other social media accounts. The Social Intelligence app compares your social data to publicly available data from your competitors. It's like having your own social scoreboard. The app also gives you insights into the best times to post, what social posts perform best, and more. Thanks for watching this overview of the Intelligence platform. For help and training, check out help.salesforce.com and trailhead.com. Have fun as you begin visualizing your own data in new and compelling ways.